Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name is Gia and I buy and sell handbags. And today's video is going to be about my June sales. Even though we're already in the middle of July, I've just been really busy, I couldn't get to it, but I wanted to do a video on my June sales of what I, what I bought, how much I paid for it, and then what I sold it for. So um, let's get started right away. And if you like this video, please hit the like button and please subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. Okay, let's dive right into it. Let's go. Okay, so our first one is the Louis Vuitton luggage ID tag. I bought them in bulk, so it came out to be about $10 for each one. And I sold it for $30. The next one, Louis Vuitton lock and key. I also bought that in bulk. And once I divided that with what I paid for it, it came out to $10 and 50 cents for, for each lock and key. I did add an unbranded chain and it sold for $89. The next one, Louis Vuitton never full. So I bought it for $395 and I sold it for $650. The next one is a Louis Vuitton. It's either nail or nearly the monogram bag. I bought that in another uh, group of LV bags. And when I divided it up, that one um, came out to $86 and I sold it for 130. Next one, Louis Vuitton, the long Sarah wallet. Now I bought eight of these. Um, in a bundle and they each came out to $44. Now I sold all the other ones and I sold three of them for over $300. So I, I obviously made my money back. So I ended up selling this one for $58. It was pure profit. Okay. The next one, the Louis Vuitton Speedy 25. It's so cute and adorable. Um, I bought that for $170 and I sold it for $303. The next one is a Louis Vuitton monogram strap. Now I took this off of another bag that I did sell also in the same month. And I'll show that in later on. And then you can see what I made total. And I sold that for $85. So I don't count that as I bought that for, towards anything because I, I took it off a bag. Next, um, Louis Vuitton, the Vernice Thompson bag. I also bought this in bulk. And this is actually pure profit, um, but each individual was $50. I bought five bags in a bundle for $250, and the first two sold within the first two days, each of them for $350, so I well made my money back. And everything after that was pure profit, so this one was pure profit at $222. The next one, Louis Vuitton. God, I sold a lot of Louis Vuitton last month, sorry. So Louis Vuitton, the, the monogram toiletry bag, um, that was also in um, a bundle I bought. And I bought that one for $35 and I'm selling it for $75. I'm telling you, I sell some of this stuff for really cheap. You guys, if you subscribe, then you'll, got, you'll see all the great deals and then hopefully you can get a good deal and, and buy from me. Okay. So the next one, the Louis Vuitton Vernice Houston bag. I bought this at the thrift store, if you guys remember, on one of my videos, and I bought it for $40. I got it authenticated. It was a real Louis Vuitton, and I ended up selling it a couple days later for $125. Next one, Louis Vuitton Columbus tote bag. Now this one came with, I told you, the five that I got, the Vernice bags. Well, this one I also had on one of my videos called Worst Handbags. <laughs> and um, if you haven't seen it, please go to that, um, go to my channel and you'll see it there. The video is called Worst Handbags <laughs> I bought from Japan. But I ended up selling it for $65. That was pure profit. Okay, the next one. I love this bag. And this is the Prada Transparency Graffiti Venice Tote Bag. I love it, love it, love it. Bought it for $192. And I turned around and sold it for $310. Next one. I got this one at a thrift store. It's the Gwen Stefani Lamb Crossbody Bag. I bought it for $7.99. So $8. And I turned around and sold it for $45. Next one is a Louis Vuitton. Now this is the one that came with the strap. It's the Danube um, uh, bag. And as you can see, it has no strap. So I took the strap off and I sold the strap for $85. 
and then I turn around and sold this just this bag by itself without the strap for $125, which then comes out to a total of $210 for the strap and the bag. Okay, the next one. This one was a loss. It was it's the Louis Vuitton Duville. Um, I actually bought this for myself um, for $450. I did not buy this from Japan. Saw it. I loved it. I used to have one many years ago. So I went and put an offer in and they, they sold it to me for $450. Now fast forward to a couple months later and I was not happy with the bag. I just did not like it. The functionality. I didn't like the handles. I just didn't like it. So I went and tried to get my money back by um, posting it and I, it kept going down and down in price and finally I got an offer of $320 and I just thought it's better just to sell it instead of it just sitting there since I wasn't getting what I wanted and so I took the the offer of $320 so that one was a loss next one is um, you guys remember this one if you see my videos is it as Saint, Saint Laurent and it's a little tote bag. I love it. I bought it for $120. And I think I, I think the video was um, designer totes on a budget for under $150. I got this for $120. I sold it to a subscriber for $160. I, I give deals to my subscribers. So you see anything put on the on my videos, just message me, comment. Uh, let's make a deal. I, I will always give deals to my subscribers. Okay, the next one, the last one is the, and this was also in one of my um, videos recently, was the Jessica Simpson tote bag. Love this bag. I love it. It's the, it's a tote and it has the cross, it had the cross body strap. I sold this to another subscriber. I paid $8 for that bag at a thrift store when I found the Gwen Stefani lamb cross body bag. I bought this one as well for the $8. I put it on for, I believe, $40 or $50 on Poshmark. A subscriber got a hold of me. I sold it to her for a discount for $20. So that is what I have. And um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Okay, well, that's it. I, that's what I sold this um, last month of Louis Vuitton. I got the fan on. It's so hot in California. I'm like almost 120 degrees. But anyways, if you liked anything that you saw, um, hit the like button, comment below. Let me know what, what your favorite bag was. Tell me what you thought was the best deal. Um, if you are interested in any of my other bags, please go to Poshmark, eBay. I'll put the description or the link in the description so you guys can go to my, my um, closets and see what I'm selling. I will show you more handbags in the future coming up in the next couple days. So please hit the subscribe button. And until next time, I will see you later. Bye.